Good morning, welcome back to my channel. My name is Flipwalker42, and we are playing Vanilla Swirl, the Complete the Monument map by Dr. Lorgon111. Um, so last episode, I made a, well, I guess a couple episodes ago, I made an epic bow, but last recording session, I made an epic bow, and then promptly lost it. <laughs> So, yeah, um, we did get up and complete the, la uh, the next area on the list. Um, however, it was not the sponge. I thought it would be the sponge, but it's not the sponge. Um, so we still have another monument block to go. Um, what we got from the last one was... Um, where is it? Here. The Mysterious Divining Rod. Hold me to locate loot. Uh, so I'm assuming it's another thing like the bonus uh, bonus glass proximity detector uh, should take me to find some more stuff. And I don't know if that'll take me to the last block or if it's just more gear. I don't know. But let me tell you what I have planned for today. Um, today, I'm going to go around and find some bonus loot. Partly because... I need more loot to move on, I think. Um, I'd really like more experience to actually get um, these items enchanted. Um, I do have... I did make a new bow, not quite as nice as the last one, but it is at least uh, Unbreaking Power 4 Punch 2. Um, kind of wish it was Infinity as well, but, you know... It is what it is. I don't have an infinity. Maybe if I find enough bonus chests, I'll get another infinity bow. But regardless, that's what we're going to do today. So we're just going to get started. I'm going to cut out a lot of this, but, uh, you know, we'll, we'll just wander around kind of like this. Find... Oh, very warm. Nice. Um find some more chests and uh, go from there. But I'll bring you back when I find items. You guys don't need to see me walking around trying to triangulate this stuff. Um, but uh, yeah, I will see you guys when we find something. Well guys, I already found my first one. So here it is. It's a orange stained glass. So we're just going to clean up my inventory a little bit. I uh, got a fire aspect, another emerald, which is good, iron chest plate. So there we go. Already made our first uh, first find. Uh, I think I am going to just go ahead and break that chest just so that I don't see it later. Um, but yeah, we're going to pull out the proximity. I'm apparently still hot. I don't know. Anyway, uh, we're going to go and find another one, and then we will be back. So, see you guys in just a minute. So, welcome back, guys. Um, we are trying not to kill my wolf, but it's really not that big of a deal if I do. Anyway, um, we're just out exploring, continuing to search for these things. I'm pretty sure I just found one. Um, looking around, I've been kind of trying to triangulate it for a while. But I just was up here, and I'll show you what I saw. I was trying to see something that would mark it. And I looked down, and I see one little flower there. And before there was a creeper blast there, there was a perfect circle of grass. So, um, I think... That if we dig down, probably right under that flower. I'm going to eat real quick just to heal up a little bit. But I bet if we dig under this flower... Aha! Uh -huh. Okay. So let's go ahead. So that's a green stained glass. Go ahead and throw the flower back in there. Don't really need that. Um, <clears throat> get rid of all that. Don't really care about the andresite or the dirt. Glowstone I'll take. That I'll definitely take. 
sure. Eh, really nothing too great here, but it is another green stained, or a green stained glass. I don't think I found any of those yet. Sure, I'll take the fireworks, and I guess I'll take the slime, because I don't know why, but I'll take it. So let's go ahead and take a look at our, look at our map where we are. Okay. Oh, zombie baby. <coughs> Got him. Um, I think, perhaps... Um, you know, I am full enough with inventory. I think I'm just... Well, let's... Ooh! Ah! Whoop! Hi, skel... Or, you're not a skeleton. You're a zombie. You're not even close to a skeleton. Anyway, um, I think I'm going to run this glass back to my monument... Uh, and clear out some inventory. So I'll be back with you guys in just a minute. Alright guys, so I was actually on my way back to the monument, but I was holding this in my hand just because, well, you know, why not? Well, the same area that I found the first one that we got today, um, it, it was coming up hot again, or, or warm, so I decided to do a little bit of exploring, because we're literally like right next to the um, right next to the monument. Come here, Wolfie. No? You don't want to love me. Okay. Anyway, uh, right here by the monument, um, right here by the same, or another chest that we got just a little while ago, but I looked down in the water, and look what I just found, guys. So here's another one. Um, light blue stained glass this time. Um, an ender pearl. Some more anvils, um, jukebox, I mean, nothing super incredible here, um, smite three, yay, but it is another stained glass. So, let's go, I, uh, like I said, the monument is literally, like, right here. So, let's go turn these in real quick, and I'll just keep you here for this. Hopefully we got some new ones. I'm pretty sure the way this thing works is it's only supposed to find the ones that I don't have. Um, but I could be wrong there. So let's go take a look. Here's our loot chest. So we got light blue, which is here, which indeed I do not have. Yay! And I have green, which, again, I do not have, so yay. All right, so making some progress there. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and clear out my inventory, and then I'll be back out to find a few more chests before uh, we move on to our next thing. So I'll be back with you guys in just a minute. Welcome back, guys. Um... So, I haven't found a new one, uh, but I was just walking around. Uh, as you can see, it's definitely cold, but there is a loot chest right here, so I'm just going to go ahead and pick it up. And I'm going to leave those there. Um, I also picked up some sugar cane, uh, partly because I think maybe pumpkin pies might be a good thing to eat. Um, and I do have those pumpkins, and I have some eggs. So that might be a good food option for me. Um, but also, I don't know. Um, I think I have a diamond pickaxe now, too. Um, maybe if I have a diamond pickaxe, maybe I can build an enchanting table. Um, maybe start doing some of my own enchants, not just with books. I don't know. Um, just decided I haven't... I don't remember seeing it before now. Uh, so just decided to uh, get the sugar cane since it was right there. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, uh, I will bring you guys back when I find something else interesting. See you in a minute. Welcome back, guys. Had a moment of panic. Couldn't remember if my mic was down or not, <laughs> but it was. Welcome back, guys. Um... Still out here looking for chests. Just found another one. Um, 
This one was pretty cleverly disguised, I think. It just had a little 3x3 three three patch of uh, whatever they call that, coarse dirt, I think. Um, but underneath it was this. So we got Grey Wool, another Ender Pearl, a few more of those. Feather Falling 4, that's actually pretty nice. Um, let's do that, definitely want that. Um, bricks are pretty nice. I don't care about the stairs. Um, honestly, I don't really care about Silk Touch either. Let's actually grab the bricks. I think, honestly, that's worth more to me than Silk Touch. I have lots of Silk Touch back at base. So, uh, I've got three more, no, four more stained glass right now. Um, so, and my inventory is pretty full. So, I think I will be heading back. I'll probably actually just head up to this quick travel right up here. But when I get up, get up to that quick, quick travel... I will just head back to base and really surely it's just talking about this one still right um I'm not sure sometimes I wonder how that thing works but uh, anyway, um, I'm not going to worry about it. Like I said, oop. Ooh. I am, have the, all the, ooh, that's definitely not where I want to be right now. Ooh, okay. Ah. Okay. No? You're not gonna... Okay. Anyway, I will see you guys in just a minute when I am back at the monument and we can put these things away together, alright? So, until then, be back in just a minute. Welcome back to the monument. Let's go ahead and put some of these away. I already have magenta. Uh, lime, I think I already have. Gray, however, I do not have, so there's new one there. Cyan. Do I already? Yes, I already have that. And white, I already have that. So really only one new one there, it looks like. Uh, but we're down to five of the bonus monument blocks that I still need. So that's good. Um, definitely making progress there. However, I think I'm done with that for right now. Um, there's a couple of other things that I'm going to do. I'm going to finally do this. I think it is past time to do this. Uh, so there's a protection for mending diamond chest plate. That should help out a ton. So now, out of curiosity, how much would it take? Really, only four. Seriously? What if I put... What if I put mending on it? If I combine those two... Okay, that seems... Why does it... I'm so confused. Whatever, I'm not going to complain about it. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that too. So, mending protection for pants as well. Awesome. Sweet. Okay. Um, I'm very happy about that. Um, let's actually... Um, 
can we do a feather falling? There's another protection there. Can we do feather falling? Um, no. No. Okay, feather falling four. Protection, feather falling. Do I have a unbreaking book that I could use? Do I have an unbreaking two? I think that might be what I want to do. I don't have any unbreaking over here, do I, right? Infinity, two infinity books there. Hmm. I could try for a sharpness five sword, but I don't think that's really necessary. How much is it going to be to put feather falling? Let's, let's try this. Let's try putting Unbreaking 2, Feather Falling, and Protection on these boots. So let's do this. Do Unbreaking and Feather Falling together. That's okay that that broke. Then do Do this and this, and then that's another eight. Do that and that. Okay. Go ahead and throw that like so. Um, what about a headpiece? I have an iron helmet. How many? Do I have any diamonds left? I do not. That's okay. Let's do a um, of course I don't have any more unbreaking. So I really don't want to put anything too crazy nice on this. Um, you know, maybe... Maybe do a pro projectile protection? That wouldn't be bad. How much would projectile protection cost me? Four. Let's go ahead and do that. I think that's that's well worth... I do wish I had another unbreaking book, but I don't seem to... No. Okay, but that's okay. I am actually quite happy with this. Projectile protection, protection four, protection four, protection four, unbreaking, feather falling. Okay, so that is awesome. Um, so, guys, uh, you might see what's in my hand. Not that hand. Come on, guys, it's the other hand that I'm talking about. This one. So, I think we are going to go and see if we can't find this uh, next loot area. Um, it says it's loot again. It does not say that it's the um, next uh, next monument block, so I'm not sure. But I think we need to go that direction. And I think I am going to use the Lucky Day potion just because I don't want to be dealing with obnoxious uh, mobs the whole time. So let's go ahead. Um, I think I'm going to drop those compasses off. I don't really need them, honestly. Um, I do have a couple more of the lucky days anyway. Uh, oh yes, last thing I was going to do, I was going to get my last two uh, bonus items here. Let's see, I have speed and haste. Um, so I need strength. 
and uh, health. There we go. Sweet. Do that and that. Get those boosted back up. Like so. Throw those in there. Go ahead and drop that uh, emerald back off. And guys, I'm going to log off real quick just to make sure that when I came through that teleporter, everything's set up nicely. Um, hey, I should have just used those golden boots. Eh, oh well. Anyway, um, I'm going to log off, log back on, make sure that I'm good on that teleporter. And then I will see you guys when I think I'm near to wherever it is that I'm going. So I will be back in just a minute. Alright guys, we're back and I think it's pointing to this. Um, I'm not 100% sure. But it does appear... To be, of course, I don't know if I'm supposed to go down underneath this, or if I'm supposed to stay at the top. I really don't know for sure. Well, it's not here, so maybe it is up top. Let's collect some of this stone or, or uh, coal real quick. Just because I don't think I remember to bring any with me. And I have a feeling we're going to need some torches. But then... Quick, fast, and in our... Well, I only have 38 seconds left. So I may have missed my opportunity there. Um, but let's see how far we can get up this. Um, whew. Okay, this is going to be an interesting climb. Um, let's actually get some of these on the bar. See what we can find here. Oop, yep, there it went. Now it's dark. That should be fun. Uh, grab those bricks. <laughs> this is. I'm glad I have feather falling. Because I could definitely foresee this being a bad day. Um, okay. Let's see. Maybe go. Over here, perhaps. Whoops. Oh, wait. That's actual stone, not... Whoops, crap. <laughs> oh, dear. Um, let's see. Yeah, let's go over here. Let's see if maybe we can get uh, up top here. Um, it is still pointing me over here, right? Yes. Okay, it is pointing me direct dig here atop mountain. Oh, okay. Uh, guess I should have brought a shovel. Why do I feel like it's a trap to dig straight down? Well, maybe that's because you never dig straight down in Minecraft. However, it seems like possibly it's not the end of the world here. Um, is that... no, nope, that's safe.
Oh. Okay. Final dungeon. Sweet. And uh, new to flying with Electra. Well, I am definitely new to it because I have never flown with it. Um, let's actually grab. Well, no. Let's just let's just grab one of each item. Um, I know how to find this now. Uh, just just so that you're aware, if you were curious. Uh, there's where I am on this map, so down pretty much in the far southeast. Um, so let's read real quick here. It says, if you've never flown, never used uh, Electra wings before, here are some flight tips which may save your life. Electra wings here, found here, can be worn in place of a chest plate to allow limited flying, gliding. You can use the Electra wings to deploy... Uh, or cause Electra Wings to apply by pressing the jump key, usually spacebar, while you're falling in the air and wearing Electra. Okay. Well, gliding, whatever direction you point your mouse is the direction you'll go. Left, right will steer. Up, down will affect altitude and speed. Be careful. Go, go too slowly, you'll stall out and fall. Go too quickly, you can crash into a wall or into the ground at high speed and take enough damage to die. Level flight at medium speed is safest. Super jump boots found Electra in this chest will allow you to jump extremely high into the air. Don't wear them without Electra also equipped unless you want to die of fall damage. <laughs> Despite these warnings, Electra flight is very fun and expedient. Equip the wings and boots, jump up, and as you fall, press jump again to deploy wings and enjoy a fantastic glide across the map. Okay, that's fun. But now, the final dungeon. The final dungeon is marked by a purple beacon found somewhere in the northwest quadrant of the map. The other items in this chest should make traveling across much quicker and more fun. Okay, so northwest. Okay, well first off, I think I'm going to go back to my base. So northwest, so that's basically the opposite corner of the map. I am going to take one more set of these, and I'm actually going to stop at my base on the way out of here. Um, okay, so like, like so, perhaps. Um, let's go ahead and throw that on. Throw that on. Okay, guys, I've never done this before. Um, let's go ahead and eat real quick. Uh, is that working? Okay, it's working, I think. Oh boy. Wee. Oh my goodness. Uh Okay. Woo, this is kind of fun. A little bit nerve-wracking. Wow. Okay, that's that's pretty cool, guys. I'm not going to lie. Um, thank you. <laughs> oh, name tags. More bricks. I'll take those. Um, name tags. Eh, whatever. Um, we'll head over here to our base. There isn't a furnace in here, is there? Nope. Okay. Oh, crap. <laughs> uh, uh. Okay. Okay. Forgetting that I have those on is not a good thing. <laughs> Oh, boy. All right, so throw the spare pair of those in there. Um, we can drop this in here like so. And let's go ahead and drop these books in here like that. 
drop a glass bottle in here. Perhaps grab another lucky day. Drop off another brown glass there. Alright guys, um, I am going to go ahead and cut the episode there for today. Um, we found lots of good... Oh, jeez. Really? Really? I forgot again, guys. Wee. Okay. Um, we found lots of good loot today. Uh, made some progress on... Oh, gosh darn it. Ouch. Um... Okay, seriously, take off those boots. Okay, um, found some good loot. Um, made some progress on our bonus monument. Made one more step towards getting our last uh, block, which we now have an idea is up in this area somewhere. So, um, overall, very successful day, I think. So, until next time, guys, be safe.